Hello guys, it's Chi Today I'm going to talk about some issues I have with being a night owl. Um, so I have five issues and I'll hopefully I'm not talking too loud, you know. Because apparently being a night owl means you have to be quiet you know, at night. Which this is bullshit. Because, you know, people during the day, they can be as loud as they want. They can do whatever they want. You know, no one cares. It's fine. But at night time, oh, you're expected to be like dead silent. You know, you can't make a noise. You can't open a chip. You can't open chip bags, you know. That's bullshit. So, this upsets me because like, Either ever just be able to do whatever I want, like, okay, you're being loud, that's whatever, it's, you know, you can be loud. Or everyone should just be quiet when people are sleeping, but, you know, it just pisses me off how, oh, I'm up during the day, so I gotta be loud, but, oh, you're up during the night, yeah, you can't be loud. That just really upsets me, you know. It, it's just kind of bullshit that some people could do more than others just because of the time that they sleep. Now, my second issue is that nothing is open. Like, if it's during the day... Let's say you don't have anything in your house, like you're pretty much, you don't have anything to really eat, you know, nothing good. Well, alright, you know, daytime you can just go and get whatever you want, you know, no issue. But at night, nope. Yeah, you can't get anything because uh, nothing's open. Now I know some people, you know, there's a lot of places that are 24 hours, but where I am, yeah, there's nothing 24 hours around here. Um, so that's fun. But yeah, like nothing's open, you know. You're, you can't go anywhere. It's just expected if you'd be asleep right now, but like it's... 3 a.m. right now, I'm fine, you can tell. I'm awake, I'm trying to be quiet though, because, you know, oh, it's nighttime, I gotta be quiet, you know, no one else has to, you know, everyone else will just sleep while I have to be quiet, but, you know, and, and a while later, when I'm sleeping, everyone will be as loud as fuck, and just do whatever they want, which is bullshit. But yeah, you know, nothing's open. And that's upsetting, because, like, I can't go anywhere, you know, nothing's open. I can't go to Target or anything, because, you know, it's not open, you know, I can't do any of that stuff. But, you know, people who are open in the day, they could, they get whatever they want, it's just priority, and it's really upsetting. Um, I don't know, I'm I'm fully functional at night, but I don't have access to things. I don't understand this. Like, why why am I expected to, you know, be awake during the day? It's just not how my brain works. Trust me, my brain, I physically cannot eat on a schedule for me to actually sleep um, during, the, during like the night. It just does not happen with me. Which just will bring me to my third point, which is school. Oh, oh, do I have a uh, some things at school. So I have a whole Blaze Rages at school series, pretty much. I have nine of those. And, um, I've, I've ranted about sleep so many times in those. Like, it, here's my issue, because school, you have to wake up at, like, I wake up at 7.40 a.m., which gives me literally 20 minutes to get to class. Um, I don't know how the fuck I even pull that off. But, like, here's the thing. It's 20 minutes to get to class. That's dumb. So, I have it at 7.40, and, you know, 7.40 to, like, 3 is so a school day, pretty much. Or 8 to 3. But you know, it, it, the thing that's bullshit is that I expected to be up or really early and. It, no. Like, I don't sleep on school days because, like, I don't fall asleep before 5 a.m. ever. Like, in general. So, you can imagine that during the school year, that becomes a problem. Like, right now, it's. This video should be coming out on, um. June 30th. So, like, obviously, right now, yeah, everything's 100% fine. I don't have to worry about school for a long time. But, you know. When it's during, during the school year, it's, oh, yeah, you have to get up really early, because fuck you. Um, and that actually gives me a disadvantage as well, because when other people, I mean, obviously no one's really awake, but, like, most people can at least wake up decently, like, may at least get, like, six plus hours of sleep, like, at least the majority of people, so they, they don't do too bad, you know, and they do their stuff. But, like, that gives me a disadvantage, because their brains are working a lot better than mine, because... Hey, they're actually awake. I'm not awake at all. You know, and I'm tired. I just want to sleep, but I have to do all the schoolwork that's, you know, requires me to do a lot of brain activity. So, that actually gives me a huge, huge disadvantage when it comes to grades and stuff, because, yeah, I'm tired. Like, I still do completely fine, you know, no issues. But it's still kind of dumb how that works. Like, oh, it's supposed to be, school's supposed to be an opportunity for everyone to learn, you know. That's why they have different classes, like special ed, for people who need more help or have a learning disability or something. And then AP, for people who can, you know, do everything really, really well. And that's all fine, but what about people who can't physically, like me, who physically just cannot sleep at night? And like I said, I've tried to. I've tried to fix my schedule. It just doesn't happen. So I'm kind of fucked there. And, oh yeah, we give people equal opportunity to learn. Yeah, no, that, that actually doesn't happen because, uh, you know, I'm not getting my equal op opportunity at all because I'm exhausted during the school year. And it's, it's dumb. And I get really upset about that. And I could rant about this probably for another, like, hour. I could, I could rant about this for hours, but I'm not going to because 
this video can't, I'm not gonna make this video hours long, so yeah. Okay, next up we have No One's Around. Now this one isn't the biggest issue for me, because at night I usually just like to watch anime and just call it a day or something like that, but like, there are times when I wish I could talk to someone or something, you know, but no one's around, and it's just like, well, now what? You know, no one's around. You know, shit, what do I do? Um, so it just kind of sucks. I mean, this one isn't the biggest issue, but I figure I'd just at least mention it, because it is kind of unfortunate and, like, no one else is awake. But at least I do have some foreign friends, or a couple friends, who still stay up late as well. So I at least have a few people to talk to, but, like, during the day, it's just, it's just so funny, because, like, during the day, oh, I could talk to literally anyone out, but then it's, like, eight hours later, you know, everyone's asleep, and I'm just kind of sitting, like, well, shit. Okay, next would be my last thing. This one is, apparently people consider Night Owls lazy. Like, at least some people do. It's like, they said this thing where, oh, you're a Night Owl, you must be lazy. You're asleep at 4 p.m., you're you're lazy. No, see, I sleep less than, like, anyone I know, so that's a thing. And um, so I sleep less than anyone I know. And, you know, I sleep usually from around, I don't know, like, okay, I said 4, 4, yeah, or 4 p.m., I was still asleep, so, like, Actually, like today, for example, I went to bed at 11 p.m. I woke up at 5 p.m. Six hours of sleep. That's actually a decent amount of sleep for me. But like, most people would be like, "Oh wow, you're you know you're lazy, you know, oh, you're sleeping at five until 5 p.m. Wow." But like, well, those are the same people who went to bed at you know like 11, like 10, 12 a.m. and woke up at you know 9 9 a.m. and they're like, "I got nine hours of sleep." You know, they get nine hours of sleep. You know, and then they're calling me lazy for getting. You know, two thir two thirds of what they got. So you know, that's that that's balanced. Oh, that's that's very fair. You know, what? I don't get it. like just because I sleep at a different time than you doesn't mean I'm like lazy. Because again, like I said, my brain just functions better at night. So I could I have a lot more creativity at night. I think a lot more at night, and so it gives me a lot more opportunity. You know, do creative things. Um, and that, that's just the issue is that my creativity happens at night not during the day, and then I get called lazy for sleeping during the day when I'm not creative. I just don't understand that. Like, it's it's just, it's not a matter of laziness, it's just my sleep schedule. Like, it doesn't mean, if someone sleeps during the day, it doesn't mean they're lazy. I just don't get that. So, I mean, I made this video just for any night owls out there who could relate, because I know I'm definitely a night owl, because I usually don't sleep until, like, at earliest like 5 a.m. but my normal sleep schedule at least right now during the summer it, it it's like any time like it's like after any time like after 7 a.m. really like it could be 7 a.m. it could be like 11 a.m. who knows I'll sleep eventually sometimes sometimes I don't even sleep but I just don't get it why like some people think that you know oh night owls are lazy and you know let's they can't be they can't be loud at night but we could be loud during the day and school is just bullshit in general and then you know like other things you know nothing's open to cater to any night owls, and, you know, that that's fun. I, I, it's just fun, you know. <laughs> I, I, I get upset sometimes about being a night owl. It's not a... I also do like being a night owl, though. It's, again, like I said, I get more creativity, but, like, people just tend to look down on it, and I don't get the point of that, just because my sleep schedule is different than yours. I don't see why it warrants anyone looking down on it. But, that's enough of my ranting for today. Um, so, I... By the way, you could probably expect a follow-up for this. I will most definitely make a part two, not anytime soon, but eventually. Well, that's that. Um, this one was a bit lacking on the like actual anger part, I feel like, because usually with Blaze Rage, I have to kind of go a little over the top with the anger. But two reasons why. First up, <laughs> it's nighttime, so, you know, I can't be allowed. Um, I actually kind of wanted to do it. During, that's why I actually did it at this time, because, you know, it would kind of, I felt like it would make more sense. And the second reason why, you know, I usually like to go over top of these, but, like, this time, I didn't because... The, this one I actually wanted to, like, inform, because this one, I feel like these are actual, like, issues. Normally, I just yell about whatever, just for the sake of comedy, and, I mean, there are things that may upset me, but, like, most times just for fun. This one, these are actual issues that do upset me, so I feel like I would just share some things, and maybe some people can relate to it. But anyways, that's really all for this video, so anyway, uh, comment, thumbs up, subscribe, thanks for watching, and play.